Hi, today I want to show you uh, two things. Uh, first one is a new impostic uh, prototype, which uh, as you can see is uh, a bit smaller compared uh, to the uh, previous one. Okay, so uh, let's plug it into a USB port. And uh, the other thing is uh, a uh, demo application for uh, input stick. So uh, let's uh, connect. And now uh, uh, input stick device manager uh, asks uh, which uh, input stick device uh, I want to uh, connect to. So uh, let's choose a new prototype. Okay, and uh, first thing uh, I want to show you now is uh, how to use input stick for uh, brute forcing passwords. Uh, so, uh, first uh, possibility is to try uh, passwords uh, from uh, top uh, 25 uh, passwords list. So, let's uh, see how this works. So these are uh, the uh, most commonly used uh, passwords. Or uh, I can try uh, all possible uh, four-digit uh, pin codes. So from uh, 000 up to uh, 9999. Mm, okay, uh, there are some uh, more things uh, I can do using this uh, application. Uh, first, uh, first one is uh, typing a command. So uh, it opens a command prompt and uh, types some uh, command. Uh, in this case, uh, it's uh, pinging uh, localhost. Uh, okay, uh, so uh, next uh, option is uh, called file. Uh, it uh, opens a notepad, types some uh, text and uh, saves it to a location on uh, hard drive, uh, in this case uh, drive C. Uh, okay, uh, Next one uh, will uh, open a Internet Explorer browser and uh, go to a web page I want. Uh, in this case, it's uh, input stick blog, but uh, it can be uh, any other uh, web address. Okay, and uh, finally, I can uh, use it to uh, lock. Uh, current session and unlock it by typing my uh, Windows password. So that's it for today. Thanks.